so students it's already august and we are just 9 months away from neat 2026 right now the question that is in everyone's head is ma'am is it possible to get my dream medical seat in just 9 months then definitely it's possible right 9 month is a good time right but you utilize this time you need to have a proper proper planner for that right you need to have a proper sequence and that's why for chemistry i'm going to tell you that what should be your sequence of chapter for droppers i have a different plan for freshers i have a different plan right and the target is to complete our syllabus by the end of the december because after that we are going to focus on mock test revisions practice and focusing on the week topics from the mock test that you will get right so now i am going to tell you how to complete your syllabus by the end of december right let's start this from the week number 1 that is uh, this is for droppers right so let's understand till december how you are going to utilize the time in week 1 you are going to follow some basic concepts of chemistry week 2 you are going to do solutions and chemical kinetics why because for droppers we know that they have done 11th as well they have done 12th as well nothing is fresh for them but they have so many backlogs so i have made a table i have made a planner so that you can integrate 11th and 12th topics that are similar right so some basic concepts and solutions they are like so for solution this is the base so you will do this together and chemical kinetics is a general chapter that's why along with this we'll complete chemical kinetics it's a very simple chapter right after in the week 3 you will do structure of atom that is a very lengthy chapter right but that forms the base of everything right now once you have completed structure of atom fourth week you will have equilibrium and thermodynamics then fifth week redox reaction and electrochemistry together right because they are interrelated then week 6 we will do periodic classification because till now we have almost completed our physical chemistry right now in week 6 we will have periodic classification right because that is forming the base of inorganic chemistry after that you will give one week for chemical bonding then one week for coordination compounds right so once you have completed all of that then why i am not picking up you see this here i have just done periodic classification we have not picked up dnf block and p block see because that is more of memorizing things so that's why we will do it in the end right now we will be doing chemical bonding then chemical bonding then coordination chemistry which is interlinked to each other right but before coordination chemistry you should know the electronic configuration of 3d configuration right 3d series that should be on your tip then after that we are going to start with the organic chemistry why because too much understanding is needed here now we are at in the end of september right and we are starting with organic chemistry and we have devoted enough time to organic chemistry Let, let's see how to do this so one week i have given you for organic chemistry do this revision everything right because this is forming the base of full organic chemistry right then start with hydrocarbons then hello alkenes and hellorenes all the chapters the sequence of the chapters alcohol phenol ethers aldehyde ketones carboxylic acid and amines right once you have done organic chemistry right now we are going to pick block chemistry right so i have given you one dedicated week for p block right even if you do one uh, one group in one day even then it will be easily completed right so that's why i'm saying that you have time right now you don't think though that you don't have time you can see this for yourself i'm giving you very less chapters in one week just one chapter maximum i'm giving you right that means you have time right so p block you have one week then dnf block you have one week and understand one thing in between you will also have festival right so you need to maintain that balance in festive season and your study because this time is not going to come back right so after that you will have dnf block you have completed block chemistry as well now guys we were left with one chapter of organic that is biomolecules so we will do this in like in the mid of november we are going to do in the last that is biomolecules week 17 week 18 is all the topics that you literally hate practical chemistry like literally cramming based qualitative analysis is also a lot of formulas and you know theories there right so then we will do qualitative quantitative analysis these two are quite interlinked to each other some topics will be similar also right 
then you will revise all the areas right after your syllabus is completed now right now you are going to revise everything there will be some chapters and let me be very clear to you try to complete it by 30th of november that should be your target let's say some one or two topics that you are left with this time i have given you extra for that right but if you are able to complete it by 30th november that should be your target then this is for revision of weak topics that you have right then 8th of december to that that is 20th then you have solved previous year of neat questions because you have completed everything now you are going to solve pyqs not only neat aipmt afmc jipma j mains as well you will solve right now here we are starting with neat questions right after that you have uh, january you have february we are going to go towards j mains questions as well right that planner i'll give you but first you have to complete this planner right after that we'll have full length mock tests from december onwards we are going to start it and after that revision and your practice revision and practice will be the only thing that will be left with, right and after completing this particular thing what you are going to do i'll tell you but please before that before december i would advise you 30th november should be your last day of uh, this syllabus right after that all we are doing is mock test revision mock test revision right now let's see for 12 pressures guys your planner is quite different okay your planner is different because some areas are very new to you you are you have not even touched some topics here right so that's why the planner is different and i know that you have backlogs also so let's see first week you are going to do some basic concept then solution because why in your case i have given you in one week two chapters why because you also have your pre boards right you also have boards right so that's why droppers definitely have an upper hand here they have more time but you don't have more time right so that's why you have to really really work hard between these days right so some basic concepts of chemistry and solution together because solution by now it will be completed in your classes as well electrochemistry is also related so that's why redox reaction first you do then do electrochemistry here then chemical kinetics and structure of atom this simultaneously your 12th is also going on and your 11th backlogs also we are picking up right and we are picking the base chapters here right so every week can you see we have base chapters we have 11 chapter and 12 chapter now week 4 is totally dedicated towards your class 11 that is periodic classification and chemical bonding then we will pick dnf block in uh, in the next phase now why ma'am block chemistry you have picked here before because you guys have not even touched dnf block so you need to go through dnf block first right droppers they have already go gone through the dnf block once so that's why even if they do it in the end that will work right but for you it will not work right so dnf block then you have coordination chemistry right you can also switch these two things you can firstly do coordination and then do d block totally your choice right now next is before starting organic chemistry because by now by september you know organic chemistry is too much in class 12 but class 11th organic chemistry is forming the base so do goc here then start with all the chapters of organic chemistry that are in your class 12th only so because these are also helpful in your board preparation so do this in detail right okay so this will help you so that you don't have to again revise for board and pre boards right you're also preparing yourself for pre boards and boards as well right then do amines and now again we are jumping towards class 11 syllabus that is thermodynamics right then equilibrium then p block then bi molecules will do in the end right by the end of october then you have november practical chemistry qualitative analysis you will do now all the areas you have covered here right now after this revised week areas solve question paper of neat questions because see at this point you still have less pressure of pre boards right so, so you can solve uh, uh, previous year questions of neat you can start giving the mock test here maybe 15 in one week right? uh, maybe 15 in one week i'm saying maybe one in uh, two weeks right in 15 days just give one mock test right now we know that by this time you will have the pressure of your pre boards and everything right so start preparing for your pre boards and the chapters that are in class 12 you are again revising class 12 here right so try 
that when you're preparing for your pre-boards, try to solve the previous year question of NEET, AI, PMT, GIPMAT for class 12, right? So that this will help you to prepare for that. Right? Your boards and pre-boards and your class and your NEET preparation will go hand in hand in that way. Right? So guys, this was the planner for all the droppers and 12 freshers. Right? Uh, I would just advise you to follow this planner because otherwise the time is flying. Right? And it will go out of your hand. Right? It is still in your hand. It is still possible. But as the time is going, it will be more difficult for you. Right? For right now, still it is, it's manageable. It's not like I have given you three, four chapters in one week. For droppers, I have given very less chapters, right? For pressure also, it's only two chapters, right? That you can easily manage. But if you think about, if you start your preparation in October, this will get even, even, even more difficult, right? The probability is going to go down as the time is less, right? Okay. But now nine months is sufficient for you, right? If you start it from the first day of August, still it is possible that you get not only government seat, but I'm talking about AIMS seat, right? It is still possible, but you need to utilize these months properly, right? And guys, if you're thinking that, ma'am, I don't know whether I'll be able to do it on my own or not, then students, we have this very, very, very important batch for you. That is DNA batch. Wait a minute, let me just show you that. DNA NE 2026 batch, right? So in this batch, right, everything is sorted in this way, right? So your planner is already made, right? Your classes will be ongoing. So you will have to attend the classes. After every 15 days, mock tests are going on, right? So you will have to study. There will be no backlogs because you will have to study for that, right? And daily quizzes, leaderboards are there in the class. We provide you DPPs, Tatra modules for your extra practice, right? Then mock tests are taken for you right? so that all the revision that you have done in last 15 days, that will be done. Like students have their mock uh, test in 20, on 27th of July, they have their mock test, right? So that way it is possible, right? So if you think that I don't know if I'll be able to follow this planner or not, then this batch is for you because everything is our responsibility here. You have only one responsibility is that will give you Tattva question. You'll have to solve that. will give you DPPs. You'll have to solve that. And you will have to attend the lectures and you will have to give the mock test. Everything else is our responsibility, right? So the batch is just that 4999. You can see this here, view course plans. And guys, if you're looking for only these things that I told you, the batch is at for 4999. If you're looking for neat quick revision cards, like these cards for your short revision, right? before the mock test, right? And before the exam as well. And as well as all India test series delivered at your home, then that is for 7999. And if you're looking for modules, Tatva modules in the hard copy version, then that is for 10999, right? Modules will be provided in these two cases as well, but that will be soft copy. But here it will be hard copy, like chemistry, you have eight books. So similarly, physics and bio also will be provided to you, right? Okay. So guys, that's it for today and all the best for your planner. Now I want just one thing from you and that is, and that is, write it down in the comment section, hashtag challenge accepted. Let's see, let's see if you have accepted this planner challenge or not and write down, are you a dropper or you are a fresher, right? Based on that, let's see how many of you will accept the challenge and will do this, right? Okay then, bye-bye.